Meg Miles is best known as a pinup model of the 1950s and early 1960s, but she also enjoyed a film career as a featured actress, star, and supporting player. She was born Billie Jean Jones in Seattle, Washington in 1932 and took dance lessons as a girl. She was determined to have a career in show business, majoring in dance and health education at the College of Pacific, and was discovered and signed by an agent before she graduated. Although Miles' early appearance were limited to being a living set decoration, she was determined to develop her acting skills as well as her singing, which led to engagements at various West Coast nightclubs. Her physical Appearance made her her favorite of men's magazines of the era, but in 1954, she landed a small comic relief role involving singing and her physique in the feature film Dragnet portraying a Cuban singer. The following year, she played a singer in Phil Carson's feature, The Phoenix City Story, in which she sang the title song. Miles was also selected to perform on the national tour promoting the movie and got a major label recording contract out of it. The late 50s saw her absent from the big screen. However, despite the fact that she was one of the top pinup models in the world at the time, according to some accounts, she was blackballed from the industry because of her insistence on restricting the types of costumes and still photographs in which she would allow herself to appear. Miles' major screen appearance during the period was in Calypso Heat Wave, which she also included the Treniers, the Terriers, the High Lows, and Maya Angelou in its cast. Miles was mostly seen on TV until 1961, when she got a major role in movie Satan in High Heels. Considered a campy classic today, the movie was an outrageous piece of exploiting filmmaking in its time and one that did Miles a little good in, in trying for a mainstream Hollywood career. She mostly worked on stage for the next few years in honing her skills in as an actress. She surfaced in Coons Bluff 1968 and Sydney's Lumet's The Anderson Tapes by which time Miles was much better known for her theatrical work, including performances at her New York Shakespeare Festival. Her last film to date was the drama Touched in 1982. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Fun Facts Library.